หลังจากสุดยอดผลงานก้าวนัดสุดท้ายที่เล่นอย่างกับทีมรุ่นแชมป์พรีเมียร์ลีกไนเจลเพียร์สันผู้จัดการทีมของจิ้งจอกสยามเลสเตอร์ซิตี้ได้กลายเป็นผู้จัดการซุปตาที่ได้รับความสนใจจากสื่อมากที่สุดคนหนึ่งเขาจริงจังเด็ดขาดโหดที่สำคัญทุกสิ่งที่เขาคิดเขาไม่แคร์ว่าใครจะคิดยังไงโอ้ฮีจัดหนักจัดไปจนหลายคนยกเขาเป็นโจเซียมูรินโยกของอังกฤษถามจริงจริงตอนแรกที่ทุกคนคิดว่าเลสเตอร์ต้องปกชั้นทำยังไงผลงานเราถึงฟินและก็วินชนะเยอะขนาดนี้นายเจลสวัสดีครับสวัสดีครับ How are you? Congratulations on the exciting season. Thank you. A lot of people don't think we're gonna make it. Please tell us how did you create this revival sensation? How did the whole thing happen? Well, I, I have to look at how we how we approach the season. And to start with, I, I recognized before the season started, we didn't necessarily have a, a lot of Premier League experience, but mm -hmm. I did believe we had enough quality. Mm -hmm. And and I think the the main one of the main qualities that have actually allowed us to survive this year um, has been the belief that we have in each other. Mm -hmm. I mean, you, you, know, you don't have to spend time, time at the training ground to see how um, how focused everybody is. Mm -hmm. um, don't get me wrong, there are times that, there are times that y your belief is questioned. Mm -hmm. uh, what you've got to do is, is go through those tough times. Ken has said you believe this is going to happen. You're not surprised how the season turned out. Well, I'm I'm surprised that we've done it with a game to go. I mean, mm -hmm, I, mm -hmm. I think if you'd have said to me two months ago, if you can go into the final game of the season needing to win it to stay up, I'd have taken that because mm -hmm. we, were, we were in such a difficult situation. The players and staff take a lot of credit for that, but but I'm, I'm pleased for I'm pleased for our owners because you know they've they've invested a lot of time, uh, of course, money mm -hmm. in in Leicester City. You know how important it is for Kumbishai to to have a side which reflects. I think the values that he and his family uh, believe in. So you know, uh, it's been a good end to the season. But now we need to make sure that uh, we don't spend too much time um, patting ourselves on the back. We've got to make sure that our preparation now for next season is such that we're a better team mm -hmm. and that ultimately we perform better in the league. People show me the, uh, a very interesting stat that mm -hmm. judging from the past eight games, where you're six one one, you'll mm -hmm. probably end up on the third of the table. Mm -hmm. Expectation can be a lot of pressure. What is our realistic goal for next season? I think we're going to be aiming for a top 10 finish. We've got to be looking to aim in the top half of the division mm -hmm. because that is a, a progression from this top season. 10. Top 10. Thank you so much, Nigel. Kapun kap. Kapun kap.